Hey YouTubers, Redneck Brian here. So this is the end. If you saw my last video, this is the end of the 18. Um, I'm I am going to be posting it on uh, Kijiji for parts or repair. So it can be fixed, but my, my uh, parts guy was saying, like I said in the last video, it's not really worth it to fix it. So it cost it costs more to fix this engine than what I paid for my other one. So this one will be going on uh, Kijiji took some pictures of it and that's pretty much it um, it's too bad it was a good motor um, but I'm hoping to get out of it more than what I paid for it and uh, the Newfie fisherman guessed what I paid for it so we'll have to wait and see so I know I don't know what I'm doing with the frame yet because the Boland's frame is in really good shape um, I don't know. I haven't yet decided what I'm going to do with this yet. Uh, also, with the Bolins, I like the rear gas tank in them. I've always liked rear, rear, rear tank uh, tractors, so I wish my uh, Troy built had a rear tank in it. Because what they say is you get so much more room under the hood, so you don't got a great big gas tank there. You got your battery, but also when your tractor's running, it helps keep the battery warm, which is good in the winter. So. I'm still undecided what I'm doing with this. There's a lot of good parts. The engine doesn't sell. Um, I'm going to part it out for the other engine, for the other tractor, junk the block, and don't know yet about the rest of it. Tires, I might be able to sell. They're still in half decent shape. Um, my buddy down the street might buy them because his always go flat. And I can get these ones off of this. And also, the issue with this one, the bent axle. The other one has a good axle, but we'll see. I'm still still deciding. Um, no rush on this one, really, so I'll talk to everyone later. Bye for now.